Hello, I'm Ryan Evans, here in a suit, walking slowly towards the camera in front of a highly recognizable building to impress upon you the importance and gravitas of War on the Rocks, a digital platform on strategy, defense, Wait, guys, and foreign... Wait, no. I still don't think we should do the shot here. Why not? What's the problem? The scaffolding looks terrible. Maybe we should just wait until they take it down? When's that going to be? That won't be till 2017, I think. Well, there's still got to be a better place, right? I mean, I mean, maybe something that people actually like. Congress is the least popular institution in the U.S. government. Yeah. Well, we need something more popular than Congress. I think I have an idea. Hey guys, this isn't any better. John, it's Washington. It's the best we can do. Hello, I'm Ryan Evans, and I'm here in a suit, walking slowly towards the camera in front of an institution that is marginally more popular than Congress to impress upon you the importance of War on the Rocks, a digital platform on strategy, defense, and foreign affairs. At War on the Rocks, we're planning a major expansion, and we need your help. War on the Rocks has been an incredible passion project. With a great team, we've taken it a long way, despite a remarkably small budget. We want to grow War on the Rocks into a self-sustaining venture that publishes even more of the high-quality analysis and debate that you've come to expect and value. We want to compete with the big dogs, and to do that, we need to redesign our website, bring on staff, get more writers, all while maintaining our editorial independence. We want to quadruple the amount of content you read, watch, and listen to every day on War on the Rocks. To do that, we need to raise $100,000. If we can go beyond 100,000 and raise 150, we can do other things like adding long form content, video podcasts, and a cutting edge jobs board for people who want to get involved and make a difference in national security, defense, and foreign policy. And if you help us out, there are some rewards in it for you. To start with, there's the swag. We also offer experience based rewards everything from happy hours to salon discussion sessions and even a brand new annual strategy summit. At our higher levels, for corporate givers, we offer custom events. By supporting us at different levels, you'll be able to get into our bronze, silver, gold, and platinum founder circles. Members of our founder circles will have their names listed on our website forever. And at the highest level, we'll fly you to Boston to play the board game Battleship against Admiral Stavridis. Seriously. But be careful, he plays for keeps. E9. Ugh. You sunk all my battleships. How'd you think this was going to come out? But why support us over all of the other creative projects and startups out there? I'll tell you why. The stats are clear. We're awesome. As you can see, our awesome levels are off the charts. We're just way more awesome than our competitors. On a serious note, our reputation is based on commentary by people with experience. And we're going to stay true to that with people like Sir Lawrence Friedman, Frank Hoffman, Admiral Harvey, Doug Ollivant, and more. Whether that experience is on the battlefield, in the halls of power, or in the best institutions of higher education in the world, we will always work hard to give you the best content from the best contributors in the business. And with your support, we'll be able to do it on a larger scale in service of our mission. Warn the Rocks is here to force better strategic thinking, and we can't do it alone. So we're asking you to help us fulfill our mission. Please support us today and spread the word.